Do you have any idea how much information can be dispensed in one minute alone? Sorel GarmD, what is a lung nodule? Are you a patient who has been diagnosed with a lung nodule? Or are you a clinician that simply wants to know more about lung nodules? This video is going to be all about lung nodules and what the significance of lung nodules is. So what is a lung nodule? I could describe it for you or I could simply show it to you. This is a lung nodule. This finding right here, here is the normal lung tissue and here is that nodule of tissue which I would refer to as a lung nodule. Now I could read to you the definition of lung nodule but if I show you this, I want you to really see and even feel what a nodule is. You can understand that this nodule of tissue does not belong in this normal lung tissue. And that's what lung nodule means to me. If you prefer definitions, I'll read it off right now. A lung nodule simply is a single, well-circumscribed radiographic opacity that measures up to 3 centimeters in diameter and is completely surrounded by aerated lung. So why do we care about lung nodules? The only reason we care about lung nodules is that they could represent cancer. If they didn't represent lung cancer, then who cares, right? The whole goal of finding lung nodules is to see, can we prevent this from turning into a bad lung cancer? Could we catch an early lung cancer? Now, what's the other side of that argument? Is it possible that a lung nodule is anything but cancer? What else could this blob in the lungs be, if not lung cancer? Actually, a lot of things. It could be a healed area of infection, which we call a granuloma. It could be an active area of infection, due to either fungus or bacteria. It could be a hematoma, which is a benign, abnormal growth of disorganized tissue within the lung. And a few other rare, but non-cancerous things. What is the most important characteristic of a lung nodule? Size. Size matters. In all aspects of life, size matters, and lung nodules are no different. In my opinion, the size of a nodule is the most important thing to know about a lung nodule. So listen closely to this little fact. In general, nodules less than 8 millimeters are probably benign, and nodules greater than 8 millimeters are more likely to be malignant. It's not a hard and fast rule, and you're not safe if you're at 7 millimeters, and you're not dead meat if you're at 9 millimeters. When they look at studies with thousands of lung nodules, which have been proven to be cancer or not, the curve jumps sharply upward around 8 millimeters. So that's where I make my cutoff for deciding when to be worried about a lung nodule. That's where I'm going to end this segment. The next segment is going to be about what is the probability that a nodule is benign or malignant. You're watching Stroud RMD. Thanks.